Hi guys, thank you for joining me today and welcome to Watch Boss 24. Today I've been taking a look at the amazing Escort Garfish 1000m automatic dive watch by Adam Tomowski of Escort Watches. Escort Watches is a Polish watch company founded in Warsaw in 2012. While still quite a young company, the Escort name has quickly become a recognised brand for watch enthusiasts and divers alike. Exco have produced several models based on classic cars from the Polish automotive industry, including their best-selling M20, which has sold an amazing 2,000 pieces. So personally, I really, really like big watches. So my first impression when I saw the Garfish was akin to something like love at first sight. This watch is big, bold, and finished to a very high standard. The watch case is brushed and sanded stainless steel, measuring 52 millimeters and 54 millimeters lug to lug. The thickness is 17 millimeters and it takes a 26 millimeter strap held in place by hex bolt lug screws. For a little extra cost, there is also an optional color-coded heavy-duty strap adapter with the advantage of a unique crown protection. If you're going to go diving and you're scared you might knock this crown or damage it, this is, uh, this is a must. The watch face is easy to read. With C1 loomed indexes and large watch hands also loomed with C1. There is a date window set uniquely at the 47.5 minute mark and a small seconds hand slept slightly on the right on the lower part of the face. There are four color variations. This stunning turquoise blue, the dark gray with the blue hands, the dark gray with orange hands, and the orange with white hands. The gnarled logo sign screw down crown sits at the 17.5 minute mark and a helium escape valve is set at the 47.5 minute mark. There is a sapphire crystal glass with inner AR coating and the uniquely designed stainless steel DLC coated loomed rotating 120 click bezel marked with a dive time scale is a diver's dream for ease of use whilst wearing dive gloves. The bezel is very easy to read and its design allows for one-handed operation uh, that's quite a clever little thing and, and it's a very useful little design let's take a quick look at the loom and um, let me just turn the studio lights out um, it's not been in the sunlight so I'm not quite sure that's going to work I'm just going to turn the lights out here Okay, now I don't know how well but you're going to be able to see this, but I mean, that loom is quite good. Um, it's not an overly dark loom here. Um, I will, I will take some pictures later and uh, so you can actually see how good that loom is. Okay, so here's a shot of the loom. Uh, as you can see, the outer bezel is green, as are the hands, and the indices are blue. Now, the watch hasn't been out in the sunlight, as I said, uh, so this has been energised only by the studio lights. I feel it would be a lot brighter if it was out in the sunlight. I think it's a great loom. The watch is powered by a Myota 8218 automatic engine with a 40-hour power reserve. It has a water rating of 1,000 metres or 100 ATM. The lugs are integrated on the watch and secured with four hex bolts. The goldfish is built like a tank and ready to face whatever you throw at it in any walk of life. Weighing in at an impressive 235 grams, this timepiece is for those that like the feel of a real solid watch on their wrist. On the front of the watch case, there are 12 symmetrically set hex bolts that remind me of the ship's porthole adding to the appeal. The goldfish has been field tested by Danek Wilowski, a Polish technical diver working in collaboration with Exicor, Darek Wilkowski 
field tests all of Xcore dive models and puts them through their paces. The garfish name comes from the fish of the same name that finds its home in the Atlantic Ocean and Baltic Sea, and the fish is nicely depicted on the watch case back. It's really a nice design on the back of that case back. This watch is designed with divers in mind and truly belongs in the water. However, it is such a great looking watch, it would not be out of place anywhere you would wish to wear it. Is it an eyebrow razor? Yes, absolutely. This is the kind of watch that would quickly become a point of conversation. It will most certainly have a lot of admirers. Possibly a few may frown at its dimensions. However, if you are a diver, you will appreciate this watch. And if you like big watches as I do, you will absolutely love the X-Core Garfish. I actually took this watch uh, diving with me in the med. Um, so here's a, a short video and a, a few still pictures of that dive. <laughs> For me personally, I have no doubt that this watch will quickly become a favourite piece in your collection and would get a lot of wrist time. There is certainly an undeniable quality about the Garfish. It looks and feels like a piece of professional dive equipment, solidly built and ready to go with you on any adventure above and below the sea. To learn more about this watch, to make a purchase on your web browser, go to online shop at exeacore.com. Place your order. Today, and you will be pleasantly surprised at how much watch you will get for the price you pay. Okay, guys, thank you for joining me and watching this review. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe to Watch Post 24 by clicking down here in the right hand corner. Goodbye for now, guys, and thanks for watching.